Hey guys, Shane from Jags Journeys. We're here tonight at Warner Brothers Movie World on the Gold Coast for the opening night of the White Christmas event. This event goes from 5.30 to 8.30 and it goes from the 4th of December until the 23rd of December. Make sure you book online. The nights are selling out really fast, so get in while you can. Uh, the prices are 49 for adults, 29 for kids. Uh, if you have a Village One Pass, you might be lucky enough to redeem a free pass to get into White Christmas. Uh, so definitely worth having a look at that. Anyway, let's go and check out the night, so why don't you come along with me and join the journey. So we're here right on 5.30 and um, there's actually not a lot of people, which is great, so we're going to head on in right now. So one of the paid experiences that there is to do tonight is the Rudolph's Candy Quest, uh, $12 each or two for 20. Basically it's like an adventure trail around the park and essentially like a trick or treat, but for Christmas. So you'll get treats at every stop that you make. So this is one of the stops for Rudolph's Candy Quest where you come to get your lollies. Looks like you get a stack of lollies too. So they've got a few games set up here. This is down there, Superman. Trim the tree, so it's basically throw the decoration onto the tree. Just for fun. And they've also got set up some photo opportunities throughout the park as well. Pretty cool. So some of the other experiences in the park, you can do bauble and mug decorating for $15 and you can also do gingerbread and bauble decorating for $15 and that's at the front of the park here uh, on the terrace near the newspaper stand. Look at this folks, got the whole of Movie World White Christmas to myself. Main Street right here. Let's bring in the people. Are you trying to take a photo without my permission? Correct. I found that very cool, sir. Bah! <laughs> <laughs> And so for the White Christmas Nights at the Roxy Theatre, they're featuring the Polar Express uh, movie, so 4D as well. So yeah, make sure you check out that while you're here at uh, White Christmas Movie World. It's like another photo opportunity area uh, next to the Village Bean, Main Street as well. It's in the plaza area at the top of Main Street. They've uh, got a really nice Christmas display. So there's no North Pole Pass this year, but you can get a Christmas feast at the uh, Rick's Cafe uh, restaurant. So adults are 74, children 12 and under are 44. It is a set menu. Um, you get a main, you get dessert, you get nibbles on entry, a, dinner, a, a drink on entry and also drinks throughout the meal and there's character interaction and you also get a gift and a souvenir photo, digital souvenir photo. So make sure you book for the Mrs. Claus Christmas Feast.
So in the Kids WB area, they have a pop-up ice creamery in here as well. Something new for White Christmas. So this is just an example of another candy collection point if you're doing the Rudolph Trail around the park. So something new I've noticed this year, they actually have a White Christmas merchandise store. Usually these uh, merchandise is normally sold sort of throughout the stores or on the retail carts. So they've got a specific store right next door to Stunt Driver at the top of Main Street. So we're just going to have a look at some of the different Christmas food offerings that they've got around the park. So they've got the turkey legs here this year, smoked turkey legs, $15. Tell you what, they look pretty good. So, and also at Sweet Treats, they have got for your Christmas dessert a frosty float for six dollars. Blueberry slushy topped with vanilla ice cream. Santa snack pack for twenty dollars. Chicken breast tenders, seasoned chips, soft drink, and a souvenir Coca-Cola Christmas cup and cinnamon churros. I think that's the only Christmas food item they've got here at Gotham City Cafe. By the look of it, and other than that, just a regular menu. So Wild West Burgers doesn't actually have anything uh, Christmas on the menu other than the same Santa snack pack for $20 that we just showed you up in Gotham Cafe. So this is another experience they've got in the park for the kids. Uh, essentially, it's $15 each or two for $25. Uh, you put your hand in the snow, try and find Frosty's missing buttons, put the button back on Frosty, and you get to choose a prize or a gift from the gift wall. It's definitely worth getting the photo package at Santa's cabin uh, compared to the free Santa photo in the Kids WB area. Just look at the theming and the lights. It's absolutely amazing. Fantastic. I'm a soldier, active service, I'm here all week. Need something tinted? I'll fix it straight up in a double click, okay? Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> so we're just heading down to the Arkham Asylum precinct uh, just to see what's happening down here. Uh, obviously the ride is not open, but there is some activity down here, so let's check it out. So we've got more photo opportunities set up down here at the Arkham Asylum area too. Pretty cool.
So you can actually get your photo on a cookie. And it's available from the Movie World Photo Center. waiting for the Main Street Christmas Parade to start. It starts at 8 o'clock. Make sure you get your spot before then and it's about to start. Please take your places now and enjoy the magic of White Christmas here at Warner Brothers Movie World. Hey guys, that's going to do it from our visit at White Christmas at Warner Brothers Movie World. Uh, definitely a wonderful event for the family. It's a great feeling. You've got to come down. It's a magical night. Uh, definitely come down to Warner Brothers Movie World and experience the White Christmas nights. Uh, make sure you get online and secure your ticket now. Anyway guys, uh, if you're new to our channel, Jags Journeys, please hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell to keep you up to date with all our fun journeys that we have. Also, please like and share our videos. That would be greatly appreciated. Anyway guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next journey.